and it, or no, it's the 48 percent as well. Now, no deal is not what people voted for because in 2016, every single Brexit campaigner said we would get a better deal with the EU. In fact, the entire narrative of no, they, they, need, they need us more than we need them no, no, is they predicated didn't. on the idea I, I that they're going to give us a good Brexit. deal. I actually campaigned for Brexit. And I made it very clear in every speech I gave we would be economically worse off. I'm joined now by the former Trade Minister Digby Jones and Richard Reid, who founded Innocent Smoothies, and he's campaigning for Britain to stay in the EU. Welcome to both of you. Hello. Digby Jones, the EU accounts for 45% of our exports. Why would you risk any of that? Well, that won't change, because in the morning after any referendum result to come out, Germany, and it is, it, it's pivotal on Germany, would immediately want some form of tariff-free arrangement with Britain. They, they make a million cars they sell in Britain a year. 75-80% of all the trains you get on every day in this country are built in Dusseldorf. You know, the, sure. You're assuming that, though. We don't know for sure. No, we don't. No, absolutely right. And, and what is more, the moment Germany did it, the others would follow, and we would enjoy that as well. The, the, there are many arguments to stay in, and there are many arguments that come out, but the one thing that we've got, we ought to kill this canard now, is that not one job in Britain is at risk because of EU not membership. One. Not one. Because there would be a free trade agreement because we're so important to Europe. And by the way, that doesn't mean that there aren't other reasons why we might want to be in or out. But I, I get so frustrated with people who go, three million jobs are at risk if we're out of the European Union. It's rubbish. Okay. It's, it's just not Not, not one happen. job at risk, says Digby Jones. What impact has the Brexit vote already had on the UK economy? There is context to the question, of course. Jaguar Land Rover says it's extending a shutdown in production in April because mm. of potential Brexit mm. disruption. Deutsche Bank is moving 400 billion euros of balance sheets assets to Frankfurt. Two insurance giants are moving to the European Union. AIG is moving to Luxembourg, Chubb's moving to France, they say explicitly because of Brexit. Panasonic and Sony yeah. are moving their headquarters to Did Amsterdam you... because of Brexit. I can actually go on, no, of course but you, you take the point. But 